Hello, my stinky poopy baby. So today I'm gonna record uh, me bleaching my hair and what it did to my hands. So I didn't have gloves, so I kind of just use my fingers, which I do not recommend. I would recommend getting gloves protection because this can dry your hands really, really, really bad. I have this old, like this which I got like a year, within a year. Um, and yeah, I wanted to finish it, so this is what I did. I just put whatever I had left, and it was what it was. Uh, it turned out pretty good, but since I kind of bleached my hair a little bit too much, it did damage it quite a bit. As you can see, do not do this at home. This was on me. I knew what I was doing. I knew the consequences of my actions, and yeah. This is how it looks. I just put it in, in my front hair. It was done after like 30 to 4, uh, 20 minutes. And yeah, uh, I don't leave it on longer than that. I would say 15 at most. And this is now. I did that like a week ago. Um, my hair is growing pretty, pretty well, and this is the consequences of my actions with my hands. This was when I was done the next day. I didn't put no lotion because I wanted to show you all how well this cream works. The lotion is called, the lotion is called Love, Beauty, and Planet. 48 hours of hydration. I got this in a box box, which... I honestly, at the beginning, I did not believe it was going to be this good. The thing that it did this to my hands, I am impressed. I got two. The one that I kept for myself is the coconut one because the other one was a little bit too, it smelled a lot too much of a flower and it was a little bit too strong for my sense of smell. But honestly, 10 out of 10, this is how my hands look after like three days of using it. The lotion does take quite a bit of time. It stays on it. I would recommend washing it out because it stays on it. I usually wash my hands and then put a little bit of the lotion, rub it on my hands, leave it in for like five seconds and then rinse it because um, something like how the texture it feels really sticky. I know that it will help a lot of you leave it on, but for me, for me personally, I did not like that feeling. So I would recommend if you are a texture person or don't like things being too sticky, I would just put it and rinse it and use it as like another soap for your hands. Because honestly, other than that, this really works. I'm pretty sure if I left it on, it would work even better. But I just rinse it like right afterwards because yeah, the texture is not for me. But yeah, would recommend this. 